This evening's session is going to bring to uh, completion uh, Derek's Euphonium solo album. Derek has been in our band nearly 40 years now, and uh, this is a, a slightly different uh, venture in terms of solo CDs. Um, but we're also um, producing a Christmas album for this, uh, this year, and uh, that we're going to try and get one or two Christmas CD, uh, tracks done as well this year. We want Derek to, to tell what has been a remarkable story in the context of Salvation Army music making. And so the CD will feature music that Derek played when he was just a young player, um, music that uh, has been commissioned for him, uh, music that has a very special place in his life and in his career as a Salvation Army musician. Derek and I have been friends for, for a long, long time now, and I have huge admiration for his sheer talent, uh, as well as his consistency and his commitment to God and the Salvation Army. Uh, it's always a privilege to work with him, but particularly so on uh, a landmark CD such as this. This is a, a musical autobiography, really. So it's Derek that's selected the pieces. He's had one or two uh, new solos written for him, um, solos that reference solos that, uh, that he's enjoyed playing over the years. So it, it's, the CD is very much his, his choice. I'm really pleased he's chosen to play The Better World. Uh, I was playing in the band at the time uh, that it was written for Derek. Uh, I was there at the premiere and uh, I've seen him shape and reshape and reshape yet again. Um, and every time he plays it, he brings something quite different. Um, to it, and so I'm pleased that he he decided to re, uh, record once again the Better World. It's his solo. We did a Christmas CD six or seven years ago, and we feel the time is right for us to produce a new CD. So we're in the process of putting that together. Uh, and this evening we're hoping that uh, if my son Philip can get out of his uh, session in sufficient time, that he'll be at the church at seven o'clock, and he's going to record a stunning arrangement of, uh, that might be him now, uh, a stunning arrangement of uh, Oh Holy Night, which I think will be uh, just a wonderful track on uh, a CD that features nearly all new music. So we're, ex we're excited about this one. I hope they will, they will hear in some shape or form the, the remarkable talent that he displays week in, week out, season in, season out. I think they will, I hope they will learn a little bit more about his life over, um, over 40 years as a Salvation Army musician. Uh, I know that every time he plays, he plays with real musicianship and with real personality. Uh, and I'm sure in this CD that will be, once again, evident. The band is constantly recording. So where it fits in is a very difficult question to answer. Right now, it fits into the life of the staff band because Derek's career with the staff band is unparalleled. There has never been uh, anybody in our band who has occupied a principal position for 40 years and done so as remarkably as, as Derek has done. So in terms of the, the ethos of the band, the history of the band, uh, it's absolutely right that we should be producing a CD such as this at this time. He is a remarkable talent. 